till we get by I'm on your side I'll be your shoulder Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Renelli, and today I'm going to be doing a kind of year in review tag. I will put the tag in my description, so if any of you all are interested in doing it, you all can feel free to do it. Um, this video is a collaboration with my YouTube sisters, being Gabrielle and this is Ella's. Be sure to check out their video. The links will be in my description down below. I'm broken, I'm still going. Going up, 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 up. I'm not broken, I'm still golden Oh, didn't you know I'll be my own redemption yeah. Alright, you so I am not feeling like 100% right now But I decided that, you know what, I am not going to make this video look like how I feel So we're about to get this video started Three words to describe last year success blessed and growth in no particular order um i think okay it's not like a moment but it's like three moments combined that makes up one moment if that makes sense so first thing first it was hitting 1000 subscribers here on youtube and um, like planning to do giveaway and all that and then before i could even blink my eye i was at 2000 subscribers and then i was like in december here i made it to 3000 subscribers i think that was the most memorable for me because i remember seeing something have to be wrong i feel like i'm being hacked because i didn't understand how i was getting so much subscribers so yeah So yes, I took a trip to Margarita. It's like Margarita was so good. It was Dario and I my first trip outside of Trinidad and Tobago. Like we've been to, to Tobago and that was it. But like together, that was our first trip like outside of Trinidad and Tobago. Like traveling is something that we would love to do as a couple. So. I am looking forward to growth. I know I said that like, that was one of the words for 2019, but for 2020, I am just looking forward to like growth on a whole in all aspects of my life, not just here on my YouTube channel, but like me as an individual, me um in relationships, like friendship, family relationships, um relationship with like Dario. I'm just looking forward to growth in all aspects of my life. I am not really into memes, you know. Like, I'm really not into memes. Was probably at the beginning of the year um, when I revealed that I had an anxiety disorder. I know that I wanted to put that out there, but I didn't know like how it would have been taken. So just to like sit down and film that video and kind of go through all the things that happened in the past with my anxiety and how it negatively impacted my life made me like really process all those thoughts again and like go back in time and that was one of the hardest things that i had to do not only that but to put it out there to make that video public and to share that video with people that i don't know or even people who know me and never know like i had an anxiety disorder my family and dario like i love my family so much like my family is like my like you could probably tell from like my videos when i'm with my family and when i'm with dario like it's just i just love these people i was thinking just this morning like there are so many people who have like youtube channels or are on social media and they don't really get like a lot of support from family members like i even watch videos where people talk about the fact that they don't really get like much support from family members i wanted to do this video but i didn't want anybody to be like around me while i'm doing it so i asked my mom and my sister could you all please go inside for like 15 minutes um which would be more than 15 minutes but i just asked them to go inside just so i'll be able to like express myself better and nobody even be watching me 
and like you know they went inside and allowed me to like film my video and they didn't have to do that they could be like well this is the living room if you want to do your video go inside the bedroom or whatever just those simple things just show me that my loved ones really really support what i do and that really mot motivates me and helps me to become like a better person I think the funniest thing for me in 2019 was doing that video where Daria and I went through a drive shoes four drive shoes and we let the person in front of us decide what we did. like that video was so so funny I don't think like I ever did anything that funny for the year and then it had like this one guy from KFC who kept saying you sure like you sure you sure <laughs> Yeah, sure, sure. Like that, and I still laugh at that, like up to today. It was like so funny. Like that video, if you all haven't seen that video, it is my most viewed video of 2019. So you all really need to go and check that out if you haven't. I would probably say Love Island. If you all don't know, Love Island is a UK show. Um, but it also has like an Australian version of the show and also a US. You could ask Dario, that is my show. A student from my mother's school um, his father died in an accident so he's differently able and his father was like the breadwinner of the family taking him wherever he had to go because he can't walk properly and when I tell you I could not take that story like I could not take it it bothered me for a while well I can't take it It's definitely road accidents, criminal activities like murders and all those things. Um, I may be thinking, I'm thinking about it too deep because I think this is supposed to reflect me. But oh gosh, this does impact me real negative. Like I am negatively impacted by murders. Every time I hear like a murder or accident and somebody losing their loved one, I can't imagine how it feels. more of self-control from Renelli like I will start and I'll be like okay I'll do my little meal preps if you all see some of my weekly vlogs because I did start doing weekly vlogs at the beginning of the year and Lord Chang I fell all the way back with my um, health journey and I need like I literally need to to get my you know get my life together we always click to say um, chicken breast expensive and fish expensive and seafood expensive and this expensive but we would take that same money to do like buy a camera Renelli and buy what else did I buy I lost my phone this year so I was on your phone and I bought a Mac but did I really invest in my health no I didn't I achieved my goal of making it to 1,000 subscribers. Another thing that I wanted was just to be at peace with myself. Like, if somebody is toxic, just let them go, Renelli. If it is the person that's worth fighting for, fine. But if not, then why are you beating up about that person? You see, I also wanted to become the type of person who reacts less to certain things. And y'all, I have done so, 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 so good when it comes to just, like, ignoring certain things. I have... Like, I hear some of my friends talking and they're like so upset because this person did this and this and that and friend, friend, friend and they can't believe. And in my mind, I just like, yo, I don't have that to study. You could come and tell me somebody say A and B about me and I'll be like, hello. Oh, I don't beat up about anything that people say about me again. I have faced a lot of fears, for example, tra um, traveling, like by plane, going into pools um, and even going like, close to the beach. My anxiety has been really, really good this year. So yeah, I had like a pretty good 2019. I have like a lot of content creators that I look up to who inspire me. Um, and also I love a lot of my local YouTubers. Being Gabriel, this is Ella's, who this video is in collab collaboration with. Those two, I've been loving, especially like during Vlogmas, I've been loving their videos. Those are my girls. I actually only met Ella this year. Like, those are my girls. Like, I told them 2020 we're gonna be lit. Jessica Bella as well. I was so proud of her because she got her Canon G7X and hopefully 2020, you know, she is more consistent and she, you know, she achieves her goals when it comes to like being a creator on YouTube. Other content creators um, is like Raven Elise. I am so proud of her. Alyssa Forever, Jayla Coria, Latoya Forever. Like I could go on and on because I love YouTube videos, but I will just leave it right there. Um, 
today's New Year's Eve and I'm filming this video. I have to see about my room still. Oh, last year, all years, I was actually in Radisson with Dario and I came home like about after five in the evening and then I just like tidy up my room, tidy up the place and said some prayers and stuff going into the New Year with my family. So that was what I did for all years. Like, I don't have a problem staying in my country, to be honest, on a New Year's Day. Like, I don't have a problem staying here because I'm with family. I love my family. Period. Okay, first of all, I would like to reach 5,000 subscribers. I would like to continue growing myself as, like, an individual. Maintaining relationships. I'm not good at maintaining relationships. Uh, mainly friendships because I'm, and I don't like to lie. I like to stay at home, which is why I'm so close with my family because we are home. But like I would really like to try working on like friendships and like being there for my friends a bit more and, and not only being there for them via the phone but like actually going out with them, having fun and just creating memories because I'm not that type of person at all. Real trying to save this year for 2020. And I would like to do a little bit of traveling even if it's just to like Tobago you all you have to live your life try to make do with what you have but like try to do something very self-fulfilling so if it is traveling if it is just going to the beach every month do what makes you happy what sets your soul on fire so yeah I have a lot of other goals but not everything I would like to like share you know sometimes you just have to keep things to yourself I like to go to St. Lucia but also love to go to Canada so yeah more creators are going to be coming with like exceptional stuff as it, in terms of like originality even beauty gurus are finding like different ways to incorporate what they love makeup but in like more creative ways also i feel like in trinidad and tobago i feel like we're gonna get this year i feel like we're gonna get a lot more of local creators and I just feel like that because a lot of people message me and they're like, I want to start my channel and I want to start this and I want to do this. I think it's growth for like me, my loved ones, my friends, my fellow content creators who I support. I just feel like growth is going to come in 2020. And one of my goals I forgot to mention is also to read more. I said before I kind of answer that in my goals but it is definitely to save more money my other resolution is to reach as I said before 5,000 to about 8,000 subscribers anywhere in between there do I want to read more like I literally need to read more I want to be more organized I want to keep my surroundings clean I want to pray more Well, myself, Kimberly Kojo, being Gabriel, and I think there's supposed to be some other creators who we're just waiting for to confirm. But we have a panel on the 11th of January 2020 already seeing like the discussion happening, you know, like all of us just sitting there and people asking questions and we like chiming in, helping other people to be like girl bosses or like bosses on a whole. Period. I'm also seeing um, me reaching 5,000 subscribers. I could already. Like, I could already taste it. I could already taste it. I could already see it. 5,000 subscribers, you know, next to my name, Renelli. 5K. Like, I am already seeing it, and I'm about to be lit. Oh, God. So, yeah, um, I'm about to end this video. And thank you so much to everyone who has supported me for 2019. I had a very, very great year. I have achieved a lot. In the comment section, though, let me know what are some of your goals for 2020. Let me know what you want to achieve. Again, I would just want to plug the panel discussion that we have on the 11th of January 2020 at the Maloney Public Library. We are going to be there. We're going to have a panel. We're going to answer some of your questions about being a YouTuber here in Trinidad. And we're also going to have like a little meet and greet. If you all want to see us, you all could come meet us. And let's just have a vibe on the 11th of January. My birthday is the 8th of January. So you could walk with your gifts one day. You know, it is. Um, check out Gabby and Ella's video in the description down below. Y'all, thank you again for the support and I'm wishing all of you and your loved ones a very blessed 2020. Y'all, write on your goals, stick to your goals and every day remind yourself of your goals and try to always do something every day that will help you to be closer towards your goals and achieving your goals. Later!